All right, so we have to talk about the elephant in the room when it comes to Mortal Kombat 1, and that is the spamming situation. Take it one step at a time. I can't believe we're having this talk, man. I this, this is such a weird conversation to have because yeah, I'm about to piss off a lot of people in the comments. So subscribe here for more fighting game content and let's get into it. So I put out a video the other day and it was showing off a fun Raiden slash Scorpion cameo combo. And just for context, let me at least show you the combo. I'll, I'll just show it off real quick. All right, so you guys see that. That's 500 damage combo, one meter, both cameos. That's pretty good. And I posted that video as like a short and I made something fun out of it or whatever. And a lot of people were in my comments and a couple of them were like, all, all, all you're doing is spamming. You're just spamming the same move over and over. And I'm like, but it's in the same combo. It's, it's not spamming. Like the combo started with forward three that kick it's a high it's not even overhead or a low and i bring that up because i'm like as soon as this hits as soon as that hits as soon as this connects as the opponent you can't do anything you're done uh, it doesn't matter what i do next it doesn't matter if i do down back three doesn't matter if i do back forward three doesn't matter what i do as soon as my move here connects to you because you weren't blocking or something as soon as that connects it's a wrap, dude. It's game over. Like, unless you have breaker or something, uh, you're not getting out of whatever I'm doing. So at the end of the day, why does it matter what I'm doing? Whether it be the same move four times in a row, which by the way, don't blame the player, hate the game, but whether I'm doing that or, you know, six different strings that do maybe the same damage, it's you're, you're in a combo you're not getting out like how is that spam like do you see my point like if you were blocking that might be a different story right like if you're sitting here blocking i'm just like trying to poke you and like poking poking down forward two poking down forward two trying to go for the overhead and then poking i could see your argument for spamming that you're like yeah i'm just i'm just trying to get the low trying to get the low trying to get the low to be fair that's punishable so you should react and punish that so that still might be on you but at the end of the day like you, like i could see like that why that might be more of an argument for spamming like true spamming might be used with a character like Shang Tsung. We got a ton of fireball options. We got one, we got two, and we even have three projectile options. So yeah, if a Shang Tsung was sitting back here and just like doing this to you the entire time, and then going between like old Shang Tsung and then doing it in the air and doing his fireballs that way and then doing it again. I can see why that might be considered spam, sure. Cause again, if we're just doing this over and over again, waiting, waiting for you to jump in and then we meter burn it to completely stop you in your tracks. Yeah, that's like spammy zony, I get it. But if you really think about it, any character could really do the same string or the same normal two or three times in a row in the same combo, but no one counts it as spam unless it's like a specific character that everyone just wants to attack for some reason like let's go and take sub zero here for an example we have four to one two and that's a nice string we use three in his back cameo after that we can do that almost three times in a row and with a down forward enhanced four then go for the air combo but that's not spam is it like here's how that looks Like, you see what I'm saying? Like, it, was that a spammable combo? Or was I just utilizing the tools in my kit to optimize my combo potential and my damage? Like, you could argue, like, all, all you do is 4 to 1, 2 back cameo. Okay, well, then all you do is get hit by 4 to 1, 2 back cameo. It's kind of like those Street Fighter people that might go, all you do is grab. Okay, well, then all you do is get grabbed. Like, what response do you want from that? It's not really spamming if I'm utilizing the tools in the game itself. I'm not saying it's not cheaper and it's not cheesy, but you can't really blame me as the player for utilizing those tools that are in my kit right like even johnny cage can do the same string almost three times in a row two one two two one two like you get the idea is that spam or is that just a combo that i put together as the player so i'm sorry to say but that's gonna be my first point of this thing is like that's not really spam if you're mad at that are you mad at me or are you just mad at the game that the game allows that like i'm not sitting back trying to zone you out and spamming projectiles or spamming some kind of move while you're blocking to really just you know kind of zone you out poke you out or whatever i'm just optimizing my combos with the best tools that i'm given with the specials i'm given with my combo strings and in raiden's case for an example my down to forward to the electric grab here that's a great move it's better than my down back to 
That's useless. I'm not gonna use that in a combo. What are you, psycho? I can't use a cameo after that. The meter burn sucks on it. It's flashy and it's cool, but it's like, it's not as optimal as like other special moves I might have. Hell, Raiden players barely use the down back three inside of a combo because it's just way easier just to do what they let you grab. And every character has, every character has optimal specials, optimal combo strings. Every character has combo strings you're probably never gonna use in an actual fight. Many characters even have some specials you probably never use. It's not my fault. And some people argue, oh, well, Raiden's just easy. He's just easy to use. You can do that. You can do that kind of damage. No problem. It's just so easy. Well, then one, why aren't you playing him? And two, with that logic, that means you think harder to play characters should do more damage and easier to learn characters should do less damage. You see what I'm saying? Like, just because the character is like easy to learn and easy to put together, does that then mean they shouldn't be doing good damage? And you see why that can't happen. Like, you can't make a character that's hard to play better damage that's that like that wouldn't be fair first of all i do agree there should be some balancing across all the characters i will say that yes i agree but for you to call a simple combo like this spam just doesn't make sense to me like i'm doing that cameo out three down four two cameo out I'm just utilizing the tools I'm given. And honestly, in that scenario, to make it most optimal, to make it most consistent, pressing three into a down forward two, that's way easier than trying to land a forward two, two combo, or maybe even a four, because that kicks them far away. Three is my best option. It's most consistent. And then down forward two is a guaranteed hit because they're so close to me. And every character has situations like that where they're just gonna have optimal normals, optimal specials. And when you put them together, again, it's not really spam because it's like, as soon as this hits, it's a wrap. You, you, like, you can't do anything, so why does it matter what I do in that combo? I don't know, guys. This is just a quick video for me because I got a lot of comments on the whole spam thing. And I and I, I, I guess there might be a gray area because, again, you know, this, this this could be spam if I'm just doing this over and over and over again. I, I get it. But let me know your thoughts down below. Are long combos that might utilize the same strings and or specials considered spam? I don't think so. Keep it civil, but I want to hear from you down below. Subscribe here for more Mortal Kombat content and take it one step at a time.